Yo, what is up, guys? I'm back to another episode, and this episode is the first episode that we actually have the video edited. Isn't that crazy? Now what you're seeing is currently background footage of Cosmix of me and my friend building it, and a lot of you are probably asking, well, what is Cosmix? Cosmix is a YouTube animated series that me and my friend are currently working on. Now, if you guys want to help out, there's going to be a Discord link in the description leading you to the official Cosmic server, where you can try out for voice acting, learn about the characters more, and even try to design your own character, because we do need background characters, obviously. This mall, like I said, is going to be an infinite mall, and not to plug in my own merch, but we do have Cosmic's merch. We have shirts, hats, hoodies, everything. So if you guys are interested, when the shop is up, we will put the shop in the description below. And we all hope you genuinely like the merch. And the rest of this video is me just kind of explaining Cosmics and, you know, how we're building, what we're building, and stuff like that. So, with that being said, I hope you all enjoy the rest of the video. And, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next actual gaming video. Now, for those of you that did stay... We are currently building them all, and we have been spending like the past hour digging out the floor and just the general shape. I've mainly worked on the floor why my friend over here has built up all the walls, which I'm very thankful for. I do appreciate all the work they do on this. I genuinely could not have built this without their help. This would have been a time-consuming project as it is, but um... With them all, we still have to build the roof, the skylight, and we still have to texture everything. This isn't even going to be the actual floor, this is just the base coloring. So as you can see here, we finished the floor. It's just a giant gray cube with darker gray flooring right now with cosmetics attached. So, here in a bit you're going to kind of see the progress that we make starting right about now. We've continued the wall and now we're finally working on our skylight. Our skylight is going to be kind of the main key piece in the series. And if I haven't told you guys already, Cosmix is actually based off of a dream I had. The dream was really weird, but we'll get into that in a completely different video. So, I'm struggling to build a sphere, so my friend had to come in and help me, obviously. Because I don't know how to Minecraft correctly, and they do. And I will say, I really do appreciate you guys as a community as well. You guys helped me out so much throughout the YouTube channel. We are up to 44 subscribers. And to me, that's baffling. Like, it... I've made many YouTube channels over the years. Like, I made one when I was a kid. Everything like that. I made one... I think my first YouTube channel I made was when I was about 10. And... It... Gen it didn't... It sparked off really well. It got a lot of views and... It had a lot of subscribers, but I was a kid at that time. I didn't know what I was doing. I had zero idea. So I ended up deleting that one over time because I lost it and then made more and then it just didn't go up as well. And then I kind of stopped doing YouTube. And then when I finally found out that I could live stream off my Xbox, that's what I've been doing since is I've been recording videos off the Xbox, which is currently gameplay footage that you're seeing now. This is a completely different way of recording that I didn't even know I could do. Thanks to my friend, his channel will be in the link in the description as well. Go check him out. It's the lead anteater 27, I think. Great videos, really good content. He actually edits his stuff a lot better than mine. He has a bunch of Call of Duty videos over there for zombies, so go check him out. But this is revolutionary for our channel because now we can actually edit the videos. And with the process of Cosmics being made, I really do hope you all will enjoy that. Because it putting a lot of effort into it, and if you guys have kind of seen anything to kind of do with liminal spaces, it's going to be, like I said, a lot like that. But this skylight is probably getting annoying, so we'll go ahead and speed up the process a little bit here. Now, with this going on, I do want to say, if you guys haven't already, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, as I do try to put a lot of effort into these videos, and it would really help me out as a channel if you guys did. So if you do... Thank you, and I really do appreciate it. So, I'll see you all when the skylight's done.
Alrighty, as you can see, the skylight is now done. It's got, like, sea lanterns put all over it, and a lot of you may be asking why. Well, in Cosmics, outside is nothing but pure white void. The only other window that this place has is the one in the restaurant, and that one's a pitch black void. Kind of. There will be more lore explanation on that later, but for now, we're currently working on the second story of Cosmics, which, as you see, now has a white floor texture. That will most likely that's going to be changed later on to a more sophisticated tile, but this is what we went with for that time. It was a very long process, and it was even longer process trying to find out what to do for the wall. Trying to find out what to do for the wall took us at least 30 minutes to do. Which, luckily for you guys, you don't have to see us go through the struggle of trying to find out what we should do for the wall texture. If you guys haven't already, go check out my other videos. If you're not interested in this one, I do have other genuine gaming videos, hour-long content, all because they're uploaded directly from Twitch. And if you guys haven't already, go check out my Twitch. It's the same as my YouTube name, MushroomBoy07. I try to stream there daily. Throughout the school day, it's about 4 p.m. I start to stream, and then throughout the weekend, I most likely try to go live around too. Try to keep a consistent schedule. I do try to keep, keep a consistent game as well until we complete it. So as you're seeing now, we are currently trying to section off the floor for the mall. So that way progress goes at least what feels like a little bit faster. And which thankfully doing the upstairs floor didn't take too long. Well, it shouldn't have at least, but we had the terrible time of trying to find a different floor texture. And as you saw, yes, they just built a fucking BB, which is fantastic. <laughs> We're trying to add lighting around the base because it is getting kind of dark inside of it and I'm punching out holes for the stores currently. Which, if you didn't know, well, obviously I should, hope you should know, but there are stores inside of a mall. And if you didn't, well, welcome to a mall, in case you've never heard of one. So, my goofy ass is currently trying to install railing, which didn't work out too well originally we finally figured it out after a while but what you're seeing is me trying to go through the horrible horrible process of expanding the circle while also jacking it up somehow and then trying to do railing which failed horribly which you'll see here in a second so i'll see you all when we get to that portion So here comes in me trying to build railing. It looks okay when I do it on this half because you know, it's an overlook kind of. You know, people around can walk around that portion, look over the mall. And then my brain died right about here. This is when they were telling me about the different floor tile, by the way. So you will see me look over at them here and there. But I tried wrapping it all the way around. And this is where they're showing me the new floor tile. This is where we had replaced the entire floor. But this is also where I somehow continued to screw up the railing. Because I tried wrapping it all the way around for some reason. And then I eventually realized that, hey, that's kind of stupid. Why am I doing this? So I thankfully do break all of it eventually, but it's a very awkward process of me trying to figure out why it looks so unhinged i think this is right about when yeah this is right about when i realized that i screwed up the fence completely and just decided to break all of it except for that little portion that i did on the opposite half so that way you guys didn't have to suffer through the pain of me breaking all the fence we are now back all the floor has been updated and all the fences have been fixed so what you're seeing currently is now the skylight and now we're working on the roof the roof is also a very lengthy, long, difficult process, again, of us just trying to fill it in. And this is also when it gets pretty dark inside. 
I do want to tell you guys now that most of these clips are a little bit lengthy just because that me and my friend were talking and some of these clips I did kind of forget I was recording. But trust me, they're all pretty important in a way because it shows you guys all the work that went into building this giant cosmos. And if you guys aren't interested in seeing all the building process, I will of course post a final product on the channel when everything is fully complete, fully detailed, everything like that. The title's most likely gonna be Cosmic's Build Finale, Walkthrough Preview or something like that. And then it will show the final product, so if you guys don't wanna see all the building and stuff, you can wait maybe one, two weeks and then just see the final product. But I would appreciate if you guys watched the building process because it does help out the channel. And like always, if you guys haven't, go down to the comments and just type anything random as it does help boost the channel. So this is now currently the underside of the roof, how it's looking, and well, we'll cut back to it when the roof is just about finished. The roof is now finished, guys. We are done with the roof. It took us maybe an extra 30 minutes to finish. As you can see, we have the, uh, the num num circle, which we'll get into on a different episode. It is now very dark in here, so we will be using splash potions to see. And as you see, we have more stores punched out. So we have all these stores over here, and two giant ones here. What this is, this is going to be a up and downstairs arcade. And coming back inside, we're going to start punching out the hole for the food court. Now, I know I didn't touch on it, but as you saw, we had three windows back there for that one store. That one store is mainly going to be the clothing store. Those windows are for like armor stands and stuff like that. I'm sure most of you all know what I'm talking about if you've seen a clothing store. Now, I did overshoot the wall once, and then the rest of it's just me breaking it out because it was a massive hole. But for this massive hole, we are currently building the food court, which didn't really come into mind until a little bit later, and a lot of you guys are maybe wondering, why is Cosmix not in the food court? Cosmix is a restaurant. And to that I say, because the food courts are kind of like smaller, you know, restaurants. When you're, most of them aren't a walk-in thing, you know, you kind of order your food and go sit down in the middle of all of them. Cosmics is more of an actual restaurant that you can sit down in. So, as you can see here, I cycled back to Cosmics. So this is our final walkthrough of the episode. You can see all the progress we've made. You can see this is the freezer room inside of Cosmics. Very, very exciting, guys. Uh, revolutionary. We have our lovely little fridge that has nothing inside of it because Cosmix is broke. Entering down the hallway, turning into the mall, that poor cat is now missing because it despawned. So yeah, this is all the progress we've made. Over here, we're gonna build most likely a giant movie theater in that corner, which I know it looks a little goofy now, but you guys will just have to trust me. This was our pain of trying to figure out the wall, but as you can see, yeah, that was the little, um, store I was telling you about, the little arcades as well. Just me kind of showing off all the progress. We've, me personally, I finally filled out all the um, food court stuff. The Caden did help me fill in the roof. But with all that being said, this is the end of the episode, so I really do appreciate you all for coming in, and I'll see you all next time.